I was having issues setting up with this Outlook 2003 uh, email with the pop settings. And this is the old way of the pop, you know, in the test account, test account settings, and then more settings. I'll close that. More settings, advanced. Those ports, uh, incoming server 995, outgoing SMTP 465, and I both checked SSS, SSL, um, outgoing server, SMTP, general is my customer's name, test, everything completes great. But when you use ATT's setup, they tell you how to set it up, pretty pictures, add new email account, pop three, and they give you this inbound att.net, outbound att.net, password. SMTP, the port, same ports, same checks, you know, but when I set them up, it doesn't work. So I will outbound, copy. Our incoming change copy. test fail this is direct from them their instructions nothing nothing other extra spaces so ATT leads you and their customers wrong and they make you jump through hoops really to get the right information so fail So now I have to put the old school pop settings in. Pop.att.yahoo.com. Lazy, don't want to do any typing. <laughs> Test success, success, success. So now I'll close this with the right settings. Customer's name, everything's there. Next, finish. Okay, now let's hit the send and receive up here, and there we go. Email's filling in. So, that's that. Thanks for watching.